This is a microphone. This is a hydrophone. It's a microphone that works underwater. It looks ghetto, I know. But put this underwater and you can record sound vibrations. It's cheap to make with an electric microphone and an Arduino so you can see the data on your computer. So if you want your sea perch underwater robot to be able to listen to things, start building. Today we're going to learn how to build a hydrophone or an underwater uh, microphone. Some things you'll need um, is an Arduino, a electric electric microphone like this one, um, several connectors uh, for to solder, a film canister, a triaxial uh, cable here, um, and some electric tape and mineral oil, also some sealant. So we're going to talk about how uh, you're going to solder this thing. So first of all, you're going to want to solder uh, your microphone. Now you'll notice that there's three uh, ports coming out, an audio, a ground, and a VCC. You want to make sure that those correspond to um, those going into the Arduino. So first you want to take your uh, cable and solder uh, that to your microphone like this. Now you notice I've already soldered some things on here so I can pull it on and off. That's very useful so that you can use your microphone on uh, different things if you want to. So I've done that on both these sides, one with the microphone and a connector here on the cable. You can just put the uh, ends of the cable into uh, the different slots on the Arduino that you need to. Uh, there is a, a ground uh, 5 volt uh, that you can plug in and your audio. Uh, or you can build a little connector like this, like I did. That makes it a whole lot easier just to slide it in, like so. Okay, so let's plug it up and see if it works. Also, you'll need to uh, have processing in Arduino code uh, to you uh, load the code up into the Arduino so that you'll be able to uh, run and get the data and the processing makes a graph of it. So as you can see here, it's kind of directional as to uh, where it's pointing, how it can hear sound. So, but let's go ahead and make it under an underwater microphone. So, first thing you'll have to do is take your um, film canister and take the lid and poke a hole in it. And you see I've already done. And uh, feed your cable through it. You don't want to push it too far because it still has to fit inside the film canister. You're going to want to take some sealant and clog up that hole so that water can't get through. Then you're going to take mineral oil, like so and fill up the, the canister. You want to be careful so it's not too full, so you're spilling everywhere, but you want it pretty full so that uh, the microphone is fully submerged, like so. Okay. And finally, you want to secure the top with some electrical tape. Usually it's black, this is blue kind of hard to use the tape when your hands are all oily. So, like so. Let's see if I can break it. Woo. There we go. So, 
here it is, pretty simple. I need to cut off the tape with a knife, but there is your underwater microphone.